when we address human creativity, I think what we are dealing with right from the start is what makes us human. And there's been a great short coming in the humanities in explaining themselves uh, in order to um, improve the creative powers of the humanities. And by that I mean uh, most considerations of human behavior, its origins and its meaning within the humanities stops about the time of the origin of literacy when we can deal with symbols and, uh, and with the first written languages and understand them. Or perhaps goes back 10,000 years to the beginnings of Neolithic civilization. But that's just an eye blink of time in the origin of the emotions and uh, the setup of the human brain uh, that's permitted our understanding the humanities and then ultimately science to uh, the bottoms of their depths. Uh, and this then brings us uh, to what I like to call an acronym PAPEN, P-A-P-E-N. And that is a designation of the areas of science that are most relevant to the humanities when they address the origins especially of the human species and the appearance of modern Homo sapiens some several hundred thousand years ago. And PAPEN, P-A-P-E-N, stands for paleontology, anthropology, psychology, evolutionary biology, and in neurobiology. These are the branches of science that need whose information on the origin of humans uh, and the deep history of pre-human existence are needed to explain the origins of creativity in modern human beings and uh, the ways and the reasons our emotions exist and rule us, leading uh, to the way that I have tried to put it in saying that uh, modern humanity is distinguished by Paleolithic emotions uh, and um, medieval institutions like banks and religions and godlike technology. We're a mixed up and uh, in many ways archaic, still archaic species in transition. Uh, we are what I like to call a chimera of evolution. Uh, we walk around and exist uh, in this fairly newly made civilization that we created, a compound of different traits, of different origins, and different degrees of forward evolution. Mm -hmm.